had to take pictures at my dance school for senior year. And when I saw my picture, I was like, who is that? Because I don't know her. So I just feel like 17 and 18 year olds getting nose jobs and making decisions that are going to affect the rest of their life is, is just kind of scary. Like Here is a before and after picture like right next to each other. Uh, this was taken the day of my surgery and then the other picture was taken like a month or so after my surgery. My nose looked better. The swelling would go down, the tip would drop, and I was starting to really like my nose and it was starting to really suit my face. Well, one week post-op and this is me today three weeks post up. The way it looked, and here's some pictures of my nose uncontoured, and here's some pictures of my nose contoured. I really just hated how flat my face looked. It's currently 1.57 a.m. I think it started when I was like 12 or 13. I just critiqued myself for every little thing. That's like part of the reason why I didn't even post that much, because every picture I would like overanalyze, like, oh, this looks too this, or this looks too that, or like, I would overanalyze everything, like, your nose looks too big, your lips look too small, your sideburns look too thick, and this is too pronounced and that's too pronounced. If I could change anything right now, I wanted two surgeries. I wanted a nose job, and I wanted a breast reduction. And I was like, as soon as I turn 18, I'm paying my money, I'm going to get these two surgeries done. And when, when I'm allowed to start wearing makeup, I'm going to contour my nose so thin it's going to look pointy like this. And I was like, yeah, I'm, I'm getting the surgery. I don't care what anybody says. Did Bob Photoshop the pictures? And she was like, um, no, I don't think so. Do you think he touched your picture? And I was like. I mean, everybody can see that that looks nothing like me. They posted to their Instagram, Oh, look out for Christian on Saturday. She's going to be taking over the Instagram page. But the picture that they used was the same Photoshop picture. And I called them up again. I said, hey, I said, don't use that picture. I said, take the Instagram post down. That's not me and they're they still were photoshopped and i'm like you guys wanted us to take these pictures to be able to use in professional settings and at auditions how am i going to be able to use this picture if it looks nothing like me my skin has been lightened my nose has been thinned and that's not me and like that was the first moment that i realized that I wouldn't look good with a different nose like it it probably does sound cheesy but I like my nose now like in the nose piercing um the nose jewelry haul like a couple years ago I would never think that I'd be making a video like showing my nose up close but I like my nose now because I don't know I feel like my nose is the feature of my face that makes it different than other people's because um I just feel like a lot of people don't have my nose like I've never seen a girl before and been like she looks similar to me like I've never seen anybody that looks like me so I just feel like 17 and 18 year olds getting nose jobs and making decisions that are going to affect the rest of their life is, is just kind of scary like that's a super young age regardless of if you can pay for it yourself or not I just feel like it's super dangerous and then but one of the other things about it was like when I really thought about it like getting a nose job I was like see if you get a nose job because like I don't like when people say um I did it for myself um I didn't do it for other people I did it for myself but I'm like honestly Christian if you were to get a nose job and you never left your house and you never took any pictures um, of your new nose would you honestly be happy and the answer to that question was no because if I got a nose job I would be doing it for other people I'd be doing it for other people to like me not to genuinely feel comfortable with myself 
And then the other crazy thing about the three girls is that they're all um, like minorities. One's Nigerian, the other one is Asian, and then the other one's like Middle Eastern. So it's all like three teenage girls trying to fit themselves into a Europeanized ideal of beauty when we're not even supposed to be fitting into that box. But yeah, I feel like I'm rambling, so I'm gonna go. Yeah, I'm gonna go. Um, if you have any requests, leave them down below. And I will see you in the next video. Bye.